Welcome to We On Podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we uncover the eerie culprit turning parts of the world's oceans red, which has now reached Israel. The iconic Sea of Galilee has mysteriously transformed into a blood-red spectacle, leaving locals and pilgrims stunned and scientists racing for answers. The lake is a popular tourist attraction in Israel, especially among Christian pilgrims who visit the country to see the places Jesus set foot. Several people also love taking a dip in the lake. However, the red color has caused a scare in the region. The water ministry inspected the lake and cleared it as being safe. It also revealed the reason for the lake turning red. A green algae called Botryococcus brownie is thriving in the lake, giving it a new color. The green algae have turned the water red. As strange as it sounds, officials say there is a simple explanation for it. According to the ministry, the algae produce a natural pigment when exposed to sunlight, which gets accumulated in certain portions of the lake. It is red in color lending the lake a mysterious hue. Officials also tested the waters to check for safety and assured people that the water in the Sea of Galilee is perfectly fine. The Water Authority will continue to monitor the water quality and whether it is affecting the ecosystem in the lake. The sudden tinge in Israel's national lake caused panic. This Alga botryococcus brownii belongs to the chlorophyta group and produces carotenoid pigments. The algae have also been studied many times and are known to produce large amounts of hydrocarbons, making them a promising candidate for biofuel production. Israel has also witnessed such colored water in the past. In 2022, the water in some villages and freshwater sinkholes in the Dead Sea area turned red. At the time also, the algae were also found to be blooming in these areas. Algae blooms are becoming common across the globe because of global warming. As the temperature of oceans rises, it creates the perfect conditions for the algae to bloom. The heat from the sun, along with nutrient concentrations like phosphorus and nitrogen, triggers the algae to grow and spread in the waters. This is what has happened in the Sea of Galilee also. While the algae do not affect human health, they are a problem for the large ecology of the seas. The sheet of algae prevents sunlight from penetrating deep into the waters, affecting those life forms several feet below the surface that depend on it for survival. Later, when the algae die and decompose, they deplete the dissolved oxygen in the water, a phenomenon known as hypoxia. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.